Hello, it's Kevin the Panda here, and we're back with my tutorial. And I'm going to be showing you how to tinker using Tinker's Construct. But first, we're going to need to know how to make one of these mild trackers rocks behind me, which, yeah. So we need to make a smeltery. So, I guess we've got to begin. You're going to need quite a bit of grout, and you're wondering, how do we make grout? We make grout by using... Hang on a sec. Sands, gravel and clay. You put that into a crafting table that gets grout and then you cook it in the oven which is weird but yeah you cook it in the oil furnace and then pops out these so you do a 3x3 three three hole in the ground like so and then you put that down so now you got that you need to practically just do an art lines actually actually no 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 you're going to require before I screw this up again, take two by the way, um, you're going to need smeltery drain. So you make that by three of the bricks and down sides, and that makes you drains. So you need all your drains, guys. So you do there, oh wait, no, not there, there, wait, it's going to be a very annoying process. There we go. We're getting it now. Um, none on the front because we need the front. The front's vital. We could add one on the front layer if there's room. So you need. So once you've done that, you need the controller. Where are you? There's the controller, and you make that just by that pattern there, as you can see. We right. So you plonk the um, controller down. You're also going to need some say tanks, and what I like to do. Let me just uh, just do that. Because there's, you can layer these, so you can smelt more in the smeltery. Or what I wouldn't say, if you came back from a heavy mining trip, you can do stuff. So as you can see, there's flames coming on, as I put particles on. So basically, you can just keep adding layers onto it. And that's just going to do that. I'm just going to do another layer on top of that, because that's probably the standard of what everyone does. So I'll just do that quickly now. So that's how you do that. So if I get some lava... Lava, lava, and you just plonk it in there like so, and then I take away that and put some gold in, and you plonk all that in. As you can see, it's in the top, getting smelted down into liquid. So now you want to know how do you get it out? You only need to use this, and you make that just by. Let me just get off that. Right. You just buy three bricks in that kind of formation, and then you're going to need, I think, nine. Yeah, I think, it's, yeah, it's nine. What am I doing saying this thing? So, like that. And that is a start. So, you're going to need one crafting table. It is quite recommended if you want to actually use it for other things, such as swords and that lot. So, you're going to need kind of pear leggings in said bricks. Brick. Well, it's going to have to be bricks, because it's more than one. I think they've got this wrong, but... So, a casting table goes down there. But the, you need a casting basin, which is basically just the other way around. Uh, that kind of like a cauldron. And a minecart. And you just do that pattern there. And you just practically just need... Oh, have I just done something? What have I done? There we go. You can have more of uh, casting tables, but I won't recommend it because you're not going to need to use it as much as the casting basins. This can be very expensive in a survival world, so stock up on your sand and grout and clay. So that's basically that, and you just right click and all your gold, molten gold will come out. Like so. So, once that's done that, I'll just show you the next part of what we need to do. do, 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 do. So, to make your tools, we're going to require a few things when I find them, because I've not actually looked where they are. Oh my god, you can have some colours partner. So, um, I don't think the colour matters, but we're just going with the standard tool, tool forge. And you make one of those by um, tool station, four iron blocks, that's why we've got the smart way, and three seared bricks. Which, that's, it's not the easiest, but depends what mod pack you're using, or... If it's just a survival world you've packed up, that could be expensive. So you plonk that down there, because it's kind of like an anvil, I guess it requires it. And that kind of like puts it all together. But before you can put all this together, you're going to need a certain table. 
do 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 um right so you're gonna need a tool station i no wait i don't think that's essential a stencil table that's it and you know what we'll grab that as well so these are quite easy to make as they are wood stencil table which is vital because you need these patterns and just from wood and that gets you the table and these patterns you're going to need to know so i'll show you you just get two wood two sticks and that makes you a pattern and you need a few of these patterns to do what you like we're going to make a hammer i think so let's make an iron hammer so we need to go and need some iron let's get smelt some of that iron down so i can show you how to make stuff that's all that down we'll put that all that back we don't quite need that now so we're going to need a pattern though so let's get a pattern we're also going to need some wood but we'll get to that once i've found the patterns well you know what just do this almost at the end oh, wait no there we go pattern so you stick the um, blank pattern in there and you can now choose what you need so you look in there for a hammer you really require two of these plates uh, like a hammerhead and a tough rod which is a stick apparently so we need where are we is that it no it's more like a hammer it can be kind of um tricky to find what you need right so we need one of these actually we need something else now i think of it we need a part builder no we don't need that i show i chose the like hardest one to do it's a pain in the butt. Where are we? No. No. Actually, in this, the. Uh, actually, uh, we'll make something else. Uh, just give up. Just give up with that one. You can actually make a. It's just me being kind of weird. We'll just make a standard sword. That's that. We need a sword blade. We need a uh, wide guard and handle. They don't all show you or tell you what you need, which is the pain in the butt. But, so you need the sword blade. Do, 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 do. Is that the sword blade? Sword blade, there. What else did we need? Nope, just go away. Right. We also need a wide guard, was that? Wide guard and a stick. So, I forgot what that looked like, now. Wide guard, there. So we need a part builder. This is the last thing I think we're going to have to make. Oh, we may need it earlier, but oh well. Part builder, part builder, part builder. Uh, part builder. You make one of those by one wood and a blank pattern. So, again, quite simple, but you can require quite a bit of wood. So, what you need, you put in the top left. And I wonder if you can do this, actually. So, if you, I get some wood, wood, let's get some planks, get a stack of planks. This will get us the wood we need. So, your sword blade comes out like that, and then you put some down there, and we need this wide guard. And we'll probably need that stick for later. Right, I've just realised something we need urgently, so let me see if we can find something. And my phone is going off. Oh, just one sec. Right, there we go. Do, 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 do. Right, we need some electrum, uh, aluminium brass, and I believe that might give me, yeah. So you basically um, put iron and copper together, and that will make that, and that has to be in one of these, unless you've got induction smell oil, which I believe you can do. So can we do that? No? Can we? Just, I don't think that's going to work. Oh, we're going to have to make it, well, it's probably best. Oh, you minion. Nope. Oh, wait, we can just get some brass. That, that just makes a lot of things easier. All right. So we just put that in there and that will get smothered. And like so. Yeah, we can make some very cool items. I'll show you some of why that's smelling. Ooh, cobalt. Cobalt's a nice uh, material. These pans, if you put not back on them, which I won't show you the effects, you'll get a book when you do this and you can just look at the effects. I can't remember more about. So yeah, you can make a lot of tools. Some like if you don't have like timber mod on, there's a axe what will do it for you. And then you can have auto repair on it. So it's quite good. And we've been going so long, it's getting, like, night, I think. Let's just do that. But that should have smelted by now. Almost. Almost. 
yes right so we need to click on that and that brings it all the way down to the bottom so we need to we've got those parts right so with the parts you right click onto the casting table remember it's the casting table it has to be the casting table and then you right click it on the let's call it a funnel and that basically just gives you one of those so you don't need the wooden one anymore unless you want to make a wooden sword which is useless so you right click on there and you use your material such as iron which we said we was going to go for and that's that so now you got the iron version so you just need to make one of these the hand guard use that and there we go so now you're thinking well 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 we right click again and then we go to the iron and you do that do you remember that stick i said keep hold of I don't quite know how to make the iron god. There's not many tutorials that show you that. I'll probably try and have a look and share the information. So you basically just make the sword, which is good about this because you can name it whatever you like. So you have to say hello and you don't have to pay XP. And that's how we made our sword. We So um, I've got to say thank you for watching. Patience with my incorrections and stuff this has been kevin the panda from the operation magical panda and now i've got to say goodbye goodbye bye 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 bye, bye.